Hey everyone, Andrew here with Server Mania with a blog recap. Today, IAAS versus on-premise server, a cost comparison. For those of you who have never heard of it, the term IAAS stands for Infrastructure as a Service, or more commonly as it's known, the cloud or cloud technology. So whenever you heard the word cloud, this is essentially what it means. Without a doubt, server technology is growing by leaps and bounds, and it isn't stopping either. It will continue to grow at this rate into the foreseeable future and beyond. That's why considering the cloud to meet your business hosting needs may be a wise decision before you invest in anything. We here at Servermania understand the leaps and bounds of rate growth and overall business demand for cloud server technology, which is why we offer great cloud hosting solutions to fulfill your hosting needs at great prices. So with that in mind, i like to show you that hosting in the cloud with a service like Servermania is the easiest to use, the least expensive, most effective and secure option compared to hosting your own servers. This will ensure that you keep up with the ever constant growth rate of server technology and as well save a substantial amount of money, time and frustration as well as prevent potential loss and damages to precious data and expensive equipment. Why is the cloud better? Here's why. The cost and effort of hosting your own on-premises server solution is huge. It may seem like a better option, but I urge you to reconsider. Let's take a look at owning or buying something outright. We know we own it when we have physical access to it, we can control it, and we take good care of it. We know it will run and last a long time. No problem, that's a perfectly logical and true for the most part. However, what this actually ends up translating into is a higher direct cost and indirect costs, as well as some potential hidden costs, and here's why. The servers themselves, of course, cost when you have to buy them outright, and when they break down or need to be replaced, you get to pay for it. Let's say you take great care of them and maintain them well. Okay, that's great, but they still need to be updated and replaced, and at some point, you'll naturally absorb that cost. With anything related to computing machinery, you have to schedule proper routine maintenance. That also costs. Also, figure in some kind of 24-7 administrative staffing for your network and servers to watch out for the unexpected and be able to immediately and properly respond to any issues that may arise. This costs a lot. Other indirect costs like repairs, network equipment, bandwidth, cooling, power consumption all cost you and this can quickly add up. And let's not forget about those hidden costs like unfortunate DDoS attacks. The bandwidth cost for a DDoS attack will surprise you and not in a good way. These are just a few basics of hosting your own server solution. What about cloud hosting with a company like Servermania? Well, none of those things I mentioned are anything you have to worry about when using IAAS or the cloud. The folks at the data center handle all of that stuff. That alone saves big money. Think roughly three or four hundred dollars per month that does the same thing except for much better than an on-premises server solution which would probably cost you an average of fourteen hundred to fifteen hundred dollars a month to run, give or take. With the dual benefit of cost savings and cutting edge performance, it's easy to see why people that switch to the cloud save over 70% in average on expenses and why switching to the cloud is simply a better option all around. With the cloud, huge data centers are able to handle massive client workloads and are always updating and replacing their server components with the latest and greatest equipment on the market. This way, you, the client, aren't having to worry about the hassles like equipment maintenance, replacement costs, add-ons, administrative, uh, cost, power, bandwidth, security, and a long list of other costs associated with on-premises service solutions. Can you think of any downsides to the cloud or upsides to on-premises server hosting? Leave a comment below and let us know. Visit servermania.com and click on blog to view more great content just like this.